Alrighty, welcome to part four. I'm getting very, very closer to to all the lies that breaking seventy seven might have told the whole internet about safe. Fuego and Ethan Andrew. So let's continue on watching here. And I was like, oh, like that's so cool, whatever, whatever. And then he was in If you're gonna lie, at least look straight into the camera every time you tell a lie. Don't look away and BS. Well, okay. Yeah, I see, I've seen that. Yeah, I just I seen that in a in a few videos made about her. Like I know why she had to keep doing that, but if you're trying to tell the truth, you gotta look straight right into the camera, not look this way or that way. Like if you're trying to gather your thoughts or say something. Unequivocally, of course. Tell me that he DM'd him and that James actually responded and he thought that was crazy. He's telling me how it was so cool that James had talked to him and that um, they snapped each other. He was just basically bragging about how James talks to him and how he flirts with James and all this stuff. He told me, he's like, I'm not gay, but like, it's James Charles, so I'm going to flirt with him. Keep in mind... Ethan has told me before that he's 17 about to turn 18. All this Let me stop you right there. Reagan, some of you guys don't know, a lot of you guys don't know this, but I, me and a couple other friends, we started a team down in Dallas, Texas. We recruited a bunch of people throughout the Dallas Metroplex, and it just didn't work out for other reasons, but that aren't relevant. So, Reagan, we can call other people. I mean, we're not going to bring anyone in, but I'm saying, you know, and I know that we can call other people. You were in that group chat. You know everything that went down. We all introduced ourselves to each other. There's many, there's plenty of witnesses. Everyone in that group chat knew Ethan was 14 years old, including you. So please stop lying. Okay. See? There's a lot of witnesses that say... Fuego has. And if those witnesses come up too, which they probably will, if they're YouTubers, of course, I'm not saying if they are, and then Reagan77 will be the biggest known liar at all time. Even though she's already the biggest known liar at all time right now because of course Zay has witnesses and these witnesses know Ethan and Zay so therefore Reagan is lying That's how the internet works. You're supposed to look people up. Isn't that how the internet works, people? Come on. Take Bradley Stephen Perry, for example. If I were to type his name right now and look him up for the next 20 seconds, you'll see his name on a Google search right here in one of these tabs. It is not weird to look up a celebrity or a TikTok star. Or YouTuber. It's not weird at all. Get your head straight, Reagan. Jesus fucking Christ. Part 5 next.